hello guys welcome to my youtube channel and welcome back again to my youtube channel my name is Anudu Akbo and today i'm going to be teaching us how to use the nimc self-service modification to our own benefit so first you need to copy the link in my bio i'll put the link in my bio and paste it on google or any browser of your choice and search for that link it's going to bring you to the home page where you can either register or log in but i'll take it that we all don't have an account yet so let's register so you're going to input all your details your name and your phone number then and click on next to bring you to a face verification page where it will show you the guidelines on how to capture your face to validate if the picture you have is the one on your NIMC if it matches so this is the guidelines so no shadow just make sure you follow all the guidelines I intentionally added this part where I decided not to actually follow uh, some of the guidelines and just to uh, detect the error message is going to bring so here the background was not very clear and then the system automatically captured that the background was not as clear as they wanted it to be so this is just to show us that you need to follow the guidelines for you to be able to validate uh, your face so this is the error message so we did it again using a very clear background and then it came out and everything was done very well so you click on next and go on to the next page the next page you create an account and you enter your otp and your password so this is just more like validating um your email address so you enter in my address they're going to send you a one-time password enter the email address click on that validate email then one-time password is going to be sent to you that's otp you put it there and also confirm the otp so if you don't confirm that otp it will not go through then you create uh your password then you confirm the password by writing it again make sure it has number it has uppercase you can see in red um, letters what your password is supposed to contain then you click on i agree and then you sign up like you agree with uh, the terms and conditions of creating an account with this on this platform then you click on sign up and then it takes you to the next page you see account successfully created so now we have created our account and we want to log in so every time you uh, try to log in with your username and password you need to always do face verification if it is 20 times you want to log in you have to always do that face verification so this is it so yeah i was trying to also verify my face and you have to hold on a minute come closer it keeps it keeps giving you instructions and then once it captures it it tries to verify it and bring you to the next stage so what i wanted to do was to change my surname so ever since i got married uh, i have changed my surname in most places i have done a lot of uh, what do they call it um cut up with that and all of those stuff but my nin was so difficult because there's always a lot of people there so i wanted to change my surname so this is it i came to this platform and then i logged in i saw all the changes i can i can make to my account so you can see the changes and their price so i clicked on the change of name and then it brought me here uh, i just have to read what is there and click on i understand then it takes you to the payment uh, gateway so you click on new payment then it brings you to where you're going to input your card details it's your uh, card number the uh, expiring date of your ATM card and then the card at uh, the number three number at the back of your ATM then once you do that it's going to ask you for your pin that's the pin you used to withdraw so you are going to input uh, that four digit uh, pin into those boxes then so once you are done with that then it might bring up uh, if you want your card to be saved on Google just say no uh, not not now down you can see it, it came up one time while uh, the page was loading so if but if you want to add your uh, card to your google account you can just say continue but for the sake of this video i clicked on not now then it automatically deducted 
1522 naira 50 cobalt from my account and i waited a little bit then it brought me to this page so now that the payment has been confirmed you see those boxes where my names are so under each box my first name is there and i can just click on edit it you edit the name write the new name you want to bear now and then you will now click on save so for every name you clear from the box you have to click on save so that it will automatically remain there so make sure you click on save don't just say you have written your name and it might not it might not actually stick so if it is your first name your surname or your middle name you have the right to change any one of them as long as you have paid that amount so once everything is done we'll come down to the documents needed so you can see from the beginning it said that um you are going to need a court affidavit you are going to need newspaper extracts you are going to need marriage certificate and all of that but on getting to this place we can see that if you have uh, for ch for marriage uh, you can just put only two which is newspaper and um newspaper and marriage certificate you can see it said that at least one of those documents so i wanted to add three but one of them was more than three mb so just go ahead and upload your documents and then click on next after next is going to bring you to a page where you are going to confirm the names if they are correct if it's not correct you can go back to edit it then after this page it will bring you to that place where you are just going to agree with your terms and conditions you tell them that you agree that the information are going to use for n9 just read through and check the box and click on submit then it will bring you to your own page where you can check your recent um, modifications you see that it has been approved and every other information will be sent to your email address thank you for watching this video and please share it to your friends and family don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel love you bye